Hello and welcome. So today we're going to be taking a look at uh, these pebbles. More specifically, uh, here's my original pebble that I got in like uh, somewhere around April 2014. Uh, and it treated me well. Actually, I take that back. I got one. Uh, then the first one uh, started to get the n uh, notorious screen glitching. So I contacted Pebble and they replaced it for me. So that actually I got this around 2015. Uh, anyways, that doesn't matter. What happened was uh, I was changing my curtains, then I knocked over my lava lamp, and somehow the very top, such a small area, could have landed anywhere, landed straight on the screen and just bashed it. So that's that was the end of uh, this, this pebble. Until several years later, which is a few days ago, uh, I received a few pebbles. This one actually works. Uh, it was listed for parts, but whenever I received it, uh, there was actually nothing wrong with it. Uh, it wouldn't take it; it wouldn't turn on for a while. It would just flash because the battery was completely drained. Uh, but after I let it sit for a while, it took a charge, and well, it works just fine. And the battery actually holds up. Didn't have to do anything for this, even though I bought this to fix that. But this is perfectly fine. So I bought another one, so uh, I can use on my mountain bike rides in case I take a tumble and break it, because I want to have one good one and then one that I can bash around in case that happens so uh here's the second one and this one again just like this one was in its box in new condition you can see the band there's absolutely nothing wrong with it it's in phenomenal condition um but i tried leaving this overnight it it won't take a charge as you can see it's flashing it's trying to boot and whenever the backlight comes on it draws too much power which the battery can't output and neither can the charger uh so it just boots again after it shuts off, and it's an infinite loop. And I tried. Um, if you hold one of the buttons, actually, it enters a little error screen, which that error just means that one of the buttons is stuck. So uh, this, the backlight's off on this screen. So I let it charge like this overnight, hoping that without the backlight and it trying to keep on reboot, that it would at least charge up. But... It the battery's just completely shot. There's there's no uh there's no saving as you can see. Even after sitting like this for hours and hours on end, there's nothing. So uh it's still good for parts because everything else other than the battery's perfectly fine. I mean it's a brand new pebble. Which is uh sweet. So what I'm thinking about doing is um you'll see uh, the battery on this one is fine. Uh so basically everything's fine on this except the screen. Uh, what I'm planning on doing is just taking everything, uh, the internals out and then putting it in here. Uh, with Pebbles, the screen is actually separate from um, from all of the rest of the internals. It's kind of like a calculator. It has this little sil uh, silicon, uh, little flexible band that goes in between um, the screen and... Uh, the innards of the board. So there's no ribbon cable or anything attaching to the screen. When you, when you take out the insides, the screen is actually still attached to this part. So it's actually a really simple swap. I just take out the insides, take out the insides of that, and just put it in there. And I don't even have to mess with taking a potter screen or anything. So, uh, yeah, let's, let's get right to it and uh, I'll show you how it's done. So, uh, for taking the, the watch part, you actually don't need to take these off. I've just decided to take these off because I'm going to put one of these NATO bands on because I want to keep these since they're in good condition and use them for my daily. And then for this, for outdoor stuff, then I'm just going to put a NATO strap on it. So, yeah, you don't need to take the straps off to take uh, the watch apart.
just like that, we're uh, we're done. That was uh, that went a lot more smoothly than I expected it would. Uh, just dropped it right in, and uh, as you can see, it works. Cause um, I guess my my original Pebble still had a charge. So yeah, you can see. Well, um, I hope you found this video uh, helpful, maybe enjoyable. Um, and I guess see you until next time, whenever that may be.